version 1.1 and I'm going to show you how to install that on the Mac and uh, for Blender 2.6 for and first thing you do go to uh, luxrender.net go to download and go to OSX and here you've got uh, Max OSX and you're it's kind of not obvious where to click, but anyway, let's render 1.1. You click on the symbol and you download it. It's about 35 megabytes. So we're going to wait while that downloads. Okay, so go to your finder, look where you found, look where you downloaded it to. Mm, Lux render DMG. Double click that. It's going to expand. Get this installation menu and you can take this file and just bring it into your applications or you can just do it right here in this uh, installer that's what I'm going to do just drag it over there and uh, it will put it in there and then uh, I'm going to get this uh, 2.6 add-on put that in my applications folder in Blender. I got a bunch of different stuff here. Uh, and then you also got presets here. And you got a little installation thing here. It says uh, a number six. It says a number six, um, 2.3, but that's supposed to be 2.64. And uh, I'll show you how to do that. But anyway, you got the Lux Render add-on here. So we are now done with this. I'm going to eject that DMG. Um, I'm just going to get rid of it. And you can see I need to clean up my download folder. And uh, let's go to Applications, Blender, and uh, I've got version 51.191, which is the latest one as of yesterday, October 8th. It fixes some bugs. So let's open that up. We're going to now install Lux Render. Go to File, User Prefs, Add-ons. Render, you should. Uh, oh, I'm sorry. It's not going to be there because you got to install the add on. So, hit install, go to where it is. And for me, it's an applications, Blender. And right there. And then that's your Lux Render underscore add on dot zip. Hit install add on. And it is now in here. So just check that. And there's links here for the wiki report above. And All right, now that I've installed it, I'm going to save as default. And uh, I do that before adding any assets or objects here because I want the, de the, uh, the default to be clean. All right, now also one more thing to do is um, that Lux render add-on the presets so we need to install that I wonder if it's in contents it is It is. It's in the package contents. Mac, and I right click, show package contents, Mac OS 264, scripts, presets, box render. Um, now 
let's go let's render and presets should be over here let's render oh there it is yes looks and then presets good so and it worked has to be in the contents folks sorry about that um, um, oh, one more thing, path to Lux Render under your render settings. Um, you have to go to your application where you installed Lux Render. Just click on that folder. Don't click on any of these and accept. Now, an add object. Version. And really need to do some other stuff like uh, on world, need to uh, add some volumes. Got to change the light. That's just a point light right there. Let's go to uh, lamp. I'm gonna change that to sign. And re render. There we go. You're now set to do some lux rendering. And it looks to be pretty fast. So, now time to play with it. Anyway, that's how you install it in, in, in Max OS X. Have a good one. Bye.